I'm constantly repairing weapons and dying like too. Yeah, yeah, that's such a pain in the ass. Well, see, the thing is, when you start and your weapon starts to degrade, you're fucked. You don't have the money or yeah the items to repair them. Exactly. But see now, man, I've got, like I've I've got over a hundred grand. Oh, okay. Well, you're doing uh, good then. <laughs> I'm not. I'm just rolling in it, and yeah, still rocking the weapons that that random dude dropped me. <laughs> oh look, there's a biggity bam. Oh, a bam's here already. Holy shit. <laughs> He needs a fart. That's what he needs. <laughs> okay. There you go. <laughs> what do you mean? Did I mean to start it already? You know, I start five minutes early every time. As my dad used to say, if you're Five minutes early or twenty minutes late. <laughs> Old school. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm one of those too, though. For appointments and stuff, I always show up way early. Um, I'm, yeah. Oh yeah. Well, you know, usually when Faulty and I are on, we just leave it like this. We just chat a little bit chat people for the five minutes. This usually just me not chatting shit. No one's actually ever there. No, nobody's usually here for the first five minutes or so. This, these streams don't bring the largest crowds or anything. <laughs> but we've got a ban. That's, that's all that matters. That's all that matters, yeah. If he wasn't such a loser, he could be here with us. But no, he's got to work. <laughs> What's Saturday? Uh-huh. On 420 Dude. even. Who works on a Saturday? Right? Yeah. Been... Oh, God, how long has it been since I worked on a Saturday? It's been over 15 years since I last worked on a Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I do like paperwork and stuff on Saturdays, usually. I do fuck all on a Saturday. <laughs> I got up this morning and I cleaned the uh, overtime. That makes sense. I cleaned the apartment and did some laundry, worked out, and then I did this. I did my did laundry my yesterday. I ordered out for dinner, which was very nice. I had crispy chicken steamed buns. Mm. Chicken were, steamed chicken. buns. Those are my favorite. Fucking brilliant. They <laughs> were great. <laughs> Never had them before. I've never actually heard of this restaurant in Inverness before. Chicken is, I mean, is that what it is? Chicken steamed buns? What, no, what the? They're, they're, they're steamed buns. Okay. Filled with chicken. Filled with chi crispy chicken. Excellent. That sounds amazing. Mm. I'm, I'm all about that shit. Green barbecue sauce on them. <laughs> um, sesame seeds. Salad. Oh, man, it was just amazing. Crispy chicken steam buns, is that a way of saying chicken sandwich? <laughs> That's what it sounds like, isn't it? <laughs> I, 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 it was advertised on their website, you know. <laughs> That's what drew me to it. So I thought, you know, well, fuck it, I'll have it all look. I saw some comedian talking about, uh, oh, what was it? Oh, he was talking about how he was a British comedian he was talking about how Americans make things so much more complicated like instead of saying pavement they say sidewalk because they need to you know know exactly where they're supposed to walk and and, <laughs> and when and where <laughs> it's not wrong <laughs> hey you know it's best to have things like that where just say what it is those are my favorite kinds of names just like all these orthopedic tests I've been learning, again, relearning all of the old ones that you just never use just because you need to know them. And it's like, why can't they just name these tests for what they test? Why do they have to name them for the person that developed the test? That's a pain in the ass. <laughs> it's 
basically a chicken sandwich folded in half. Looks pretty tasty. It sounds tasty. But it's, oh, hey, it's, we're good to go. We're ready to start. It's the whole thing with steamed buns. I've, I've heard about them so many times. People talking about, you know, uh, like Korean steamed buns, Chinese steamed buns, all these mm -hmm. sort of things. But I've never found anywhere that does it. <laughs> I don't know if Until... I've ever had them. Oh, you need to, need to, man. Oh, it's just... Yeah, I, I don't do a whole lot of Chinese. I don't like Chinese food all that much. Um, I love Thai a lot. I love like sushi, but a lot of Chinese stuff, at least around here, is just isn't it good. It's not good stuff. Okay, let's see. Let's uh, Resident Evil start. Resident Evil. So what I did. I Oh, nope. <laughs> God damn buttons. Evil. <laughs> right away. Right away. <laughs> fucking buttons. It's like these stupid fucking guns. Ah. Oh, whatever. I heard you at Carnage Chronicles. Oh, this bow doesn't work good. This is a Come piece on, of man, shit. Man. <laughs> that bow was like when rolled up paper at somebody. It was fucking awful. <laughs> Yeah, those early weapons are not I, very I, powerful. I the more damage hitting people with the bow itself rather than shooting the fucking arrows at them. <laughs> Let's go steam some zombie buns. All right, so I uh, ran back to this room here. We had never been to this room. Yeah, I just wanted to get here because we actually ended the last stream in the palace in that save room on the second floor. I was like, I just want to go get the second blue indigo plate so we're just there we can keep going without me running everywhere and looking for it so that's all i've done that's just part of the fun though man it's just running about looking for shit that you yeah can't. it can get kind of annoying though when you're <laughs> seems to be a picture of this room dun, dun, dun. Hmm. would be even creepier if it's, i was painted in there looking but back. it needs to be a it needs to be a picture of the room the picture of the room. Yeah, we need a picture over here, but here's the other plate. Uh, hell's yeah, I'll take it. Okay. Uh, how many times do you die getting to this point? Oh, uh, not at all. Oh, I haven't died. Le well, I don't know about... Have I died at all in this game? I don't think I, don't I have. Think so. You've come pretty damn close. Yeah. Man's poor. Okay, so uh, we need a... Go back, go back to that picture a second. Okay. That dude has just fallen off that rock and twisted his ankle. Look at him. Oh, I thought he was just like farting. Like, oh, <laughs> wait up, wait up, boys. Wait up. Oh, fuck my ankle. Oh. Yeah, I think you're just having some PTSD. <laughs> Blee, fuck, Did I hit a wall? There's a difference. I didn't fall off anything. I hit a fucking wall. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, we need to get another painting to put here. I bet you it's that skeleton painting upstairs that we I'll can't that we can't get to right now. I don't remember fuck all what happened so far in this game. <laughs> <laughs> this is a great one. I, I just love the story in this game. Van, oh. have you watched any of Sweet Home on Netflix? We were discussing this earlier. Oh, Greg and I were discussing. I'm not really sure where to go from here. I think if I go out this way. Why is it so dark? Ah, uh, because it's dark in there. <laughs> Sweet home. Sweet home. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, that's where I want to go. Oh, run! Ah, oh, no, no, no! Fucking dogs. The worm. That's all they want. Yeah. Ah, worm. Ah! Ah! Oh, where the hell's the thing? Oh, there it is. I was trying to go in the window. <laughs> hey, anyway, I can get in. <laughs> anyway, you can get away from the worm. I don't know. I don't think. Is this gonna work? Um. 
Oh, I need a card. I need... Oh, do I have a silver? Ah, you're oh. a funny man. Funny man. <laughs> Sweet ohm. I get it. Okay, let's start this one. Alright, I gotta go up. This way. Oh, I hate that fucking buzzer. Really like to shut that thing up. More dogs! Ah! Up! Thank God they don't know how to walk upstairs. <laughs> They're very specific guard dogs. Just that little area. <laughs> yes, it's called Sweet Home. It's a South Korean series. It's, it's like a. It's no other way, but it's, it's on it's Netflix. Monster. Yeah, it's it's like a monster film in a series. Um, and it's it's messed up, and I'm not entirely sure what the hell is going on. <laughs> I have uh, an it's entertaining. Uh, it's made for TV special effects. It, I started watching it. It looked pretty good. It looked pretty sick. Ah. Uh, There is another one. I can't. So Alice in Borderland or something like that. That's a. I don't. I think that one might be a Japanese one. It is really, really good. Okay, so let's see. There's two seasons of that one, and I've really liked both of them. What we got here. It's a blue card. But well, you had to zoom in and find out. I don't think I can zoom. Shining Emblem Indigo Blue. You can use this facility, military training facility. Okay. Maybe... I'll go ahead and save while I'm here. Unless you're in Resident Evil 2 and you hear Mr. X stomping around out there. <laughs> okay. It's not freaking worth a million dogs. <laughs> Why is there so many dogs on this island? I don't know. Can you, is there, your mic is kind of quiet, dude. Can, uh, is there any settings you can use to turn it up? That, that sounds a little better. Yeah, it was it was going through my headset mic oh. rather than the, the camera mic. Yeah, you're you're okay. I asked her about if she watch she watches those shows that she's from Asia land. We had to narrow it down, man. Yeah, <laughs> you know, one of those lands. Once again, it's all the same. <laughs> It's like Scottish and Irish. <laughs> I know a lot of big hairy bastards that would fuck you up for saying that. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> I wonder if I can use this one down at that. What do I have over here? Okay, it's locked on the other side. Um... Some place where it right is a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> I love rice. I, I like rice. I use rice all the time. I wonder if Best I thing to use rice for is burritos. I like it on everything. I, I, I like to I make a lot of chicken curry. It's one of my favorite things. And I use a lot of rice there. That's why you never take a 10-minute shit if you're always eating curry. <laughs> that's not me. That's Bam. 
No need for this now. Where the fuck do I use this goddamn thing at? I go back where what's his face was, where Steve was. I was going to use my Sony's tonight, but I'm not sure in the charge level of them. I haven't beat tacos again. But the best headphones. Oh, yeah? In the goddamn world. Ah, dogs! Best headphones that I've tested. These are really nice, except they sometimes it feels like they're sucking my ears out, my eardrums out. <laughs> I don't know this. <laughs> That, unfortunately, is a bit like those. They have, you know, active noise cancelling. Yeah, the noise cancelling on these are oh. great. They work so well. At, at times, it does feel like there's a plunger on mm -hmm. each ear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they are great, though. See, if you just want to, you know, not have to listen to people's horseshit, put those on. Even if you're not playing music or anything, just turn them on. It's, and noise cancelling it kicks is amazing in. how well it works. What do I need this card for? Let's go back here. Is there something I can use it for downstairs? I can slice Steve's neck with it, just sharpen up with it. Holy shit, it's dark in here. You know why that is? Because there's no light. There's no light. <laughs> you heard it here first, kids. That's right. It's dark because there's no light. I think I already got what was in there, yeah. Well, it was ammo, I think. Yeah. But I feel like there was a place I could use one of those, that, this card in here. Well, it said the military, military facility, didn't it? That's that what I'm in. Yeah. yeah, military training facility. Okay, there's that big green gate there. I think I can open that. PlayStation Plus Elite headphones. Oh, right there. Problem. How much are they? Can I ask? Six hundred dollars. <laughs> oh wait, it's not okay. Apple. Yeah, right here. Wait a minute. They're Sony, so seven hundred dollars. Yeah. Right, well, what am I talking about? Those were those were exactly cheap. Okay, can I use this here? I can. Right on there for that's not bad. Yeah. Are they garish? Or are they white and blue and Ooh, grenade launcher? Oh, it's pretty uh, much yes. I like grenade launchers. Oh! This way! Oh! Right there! <laughs> God damn! Do I have any health? I don't have any health. Oh. This game is so brutal. It appears to have been destroyed violently. possible that the T-Virus leaked from here. They're a different color at this point. I'll probably get a black pair. Black hides most stains when I shit. <laughs> what the hell are you so, doing with your headphones? I mean, the headphones they're not called are... headphones because you're like, you're getting head from them. <laughs> like, oh, I can't enter. Fuck. The headphones I have are the Sony WH-1000XM4s. Uh, but they will be expensive in dollar land because they're £223 here. 
Okay, so I need to... They are oh. fucking fantastic. Um, I think that I might... God, I don't want to use these if I don't have to. I'm gonna, just in case. All right. Agreed. It is ridiculous, but... Oh, it, is one, it is one of these things where uh, you seriously get what you pay for. Okay. Okay. Because when I was looking for, you know, new headphones everywhere that I looked, every review I read, they came out on top. Yeah. The first thing I did was listen to Nirvana's Unplugged in New York through them. And you've got no idea how much dialogue you actually miss with shit headphones. <laughs> you know, without having to, like, turn everything up to, you know, 11 and blow your eardrums out. Yeah. You can, you can hear everything. What's this? Oh, I'll take those. I just wish I had a something I could use to clip my just wear my VR ears for just regular audio, not just VR. Those things, man, they're amazing. <laughs> Such good sound, and it's just well, all you need is like a 3D printed halo, really. Yeah. Well, I think this I mean, is. I mean, you're, you're you're a doctor. Just get one of the medical things that screw into your skull. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> one of those. Yeah. Yeah, whatever that's called. <laughs> it's called a halo. Oh, well, for there you go. <laughs> ah. Oh no, this glass, this glass cabinet. I secure. know. Yes. I can't just you know fuck up with the the, the butt of my pistol. <laughs> that looks like weapon or ammo there, but it's not. Hey. Son of a gun. I was watching this guy earlier on Residents of Evil playing uh, Resident Evil 1 Remake with knife only. He was all the way at the end when I was there, but yeah, he didn't use anything but the knife the whole time. It was crazy. He was doing it fast, too. How, how do you beat something like the big snake? For example, I just chased it around. He just kept hitting it with the knife until it died. <laughs> the boss Some was really, really different. Yeah, the boss that was really tough um, was that when you put the four masks in and that um, crimson head comes out of that big coffin and chases you around. But he got through it. He didn't die the whole time I watched it. He only saved like maybe four times. Okay, there's a. Another one of those things in here. Where am I at? Oh. Oh well, shit, that's this. Oh, maybe that's the other side? I think that's it. Okay. No, there's something else in here. Yeah, it's the other side of that thing. There's like a explosive mouth yeah, there's... there. How do I get to that? You don't. It's just there to hack you off. God damn it. I just don't know what to do now. I wonder if I have to go, if there's a... Is there, is there nothing else in that room you just unlocked? Because you got the grenade launcher. 
Yeah, no, it, t- it went back to that one area that I was just in, on the other side oh. of those barrels. That, can, so you, can, it, not get up, can you not get up in those barrels from the other side? Ha, huh, I don't think so. I'm not getting molested by that stretch Armstrong guy. Well, I killed the two guys over there. I don't know where the hell is he's back. Oh, no, not this one. It's back this way. Yeah, there's another one here. What the fuck? Fuck! Oh my god, they're both here! What the fuck? Jesus, god! Ah! No, no, no! No! <laughs> no, fuck you! Oh! Son of a bitch! <laughs> You're getting more of these. Oh! <laughs> Just because I've not been able to do it. That's the first time I've died in this game. God damn it. God, I hate those sons of bitches. Oh, here, let's take that, so at least I have some health. Oh, son of a bitch. Hey, I went out. There we are. <sighs> Motherfuckers. Never mind, eh? Okay. There's a lot of doors you haven't gone through. I've been, I think, through all of them. There's two on here I have not been through on this floor. Oh, and there's one to the side here. Oh, I didn't know I could zoom in on this. That's nice. This is on the second floor, so I feel like this this over here is where that is where the um, that skeleton poster is. I'm not sure about this one. It looks like it must be on the other side of that area where what's his face? Meet Steve. It's annoying Steve is yeah. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, I've got to run upstairs. Don't get winded. Get winded just get off his seat. He's probably been shitting this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, dogs. Again, they are the worst guard dogs. <laughs> Just terrible. Okay. So, that lo the wooden door in there, what's in there? I've forgotten. Uh, it's just a little, it's a room, no, nothing important. We got, we got, uh, I think we got the bolt gun out of there, maybe? But I already have that, so. Oh, dogs! <laughs> okay. It'd be good if it was a mod for this game where you could turn them into a truly useless breed. Yeah. You know, like French Bulldogs. You know, if you change them, you could totally understand being able to run around those fuckers. <laughs> All they do is like slobber and fart. <laughs> and snore and fart. That's if they even paid you any attention anyway. 
Yeah, it's like my friend had a basset hound once when I was in Kansas, man. That dog was such a pain in the ass, too, because they would just let him... Uh, let him out when he they he'd he'd walk to work, or run. He'd start running, and the guys would like wait till he was good, you know, several blocks away, and then they'd open the door and let that dog out. Since it's a bloodhound, it would just he'd get to work. You'd see him running down the alley, and then you'd see this basset hound running behind him. Woof, woof, woof. <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> I mean, I had I had three French bulldogs. Oh my god, that why? <laughs> the ex wanted three French bulldogs and I wanted a simple life, so I said okay. <laughs> That's nuts. Man, those dogs fucking suck. They are the worst. You cannot train them, they do not do a damn thing you tell them to do. <laughs> and they're angry as fuck. Well, you know. You would be too. If you looked like one of those dogs, you couldn't breathe. <laughs> you know, but they're a sort of stupid breed. They'll be having a go at something. You know, and then they'll decide that because they're both having a go at that one thing, that only one of them's allowed to have a go at it. So then yeah. they start fighting each other. And before you know it, it's just this angry as fuck tumbleweed bellowing about your, your, your living room, just chewing the shit out of everything. Dog you, fights get are off the old, you get not pulled off in your leather with a slipper behind yeah. the you. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go ahead get you. There's no reason to go in that one room where I died right now. Okay. And we've got stuff in there, but we can't use it because it's locked behind that. I mean, my grenade launcher certainly couldn't handle a glass pane. <laughs> just the butt of yeah. it, I would think. Oh yeah, just twats it a couple of times. Right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Aha, there's... Okay, so how do I get there? It's one way. There's a door down at the end of it. Yeah, but look, there's an arrow pointing. Yeah, I know. I, that, yeah. I just need to figure out how to get there. And this is one of these sick joke in gaming where it shows you it, but you can't actually get it. Mm -hmm. I found that down like too. I found a spot where you could... Using your parasail thing, go from one bit of the map to the other. I thought, probably not, I'll use it. But no, it just tells you how it bounds and then just pigs you back. <laughs> if you want to get, you have to just... Hey, Dave. Fast, fast travel places. You're right, Dave. Dave, Dave, a good clap. Here's a door that I have not used yet. Aha, yes. Oh, he's a dead guy. Nah, he's fine. But I'm just like creepy little guy. He'll be back on top of no boy. No this talk. guy looks like he's gonna come back. All of them. I don't trust any of them. Okay, where are we here? It's a sad state of affairs. You can't even trust the dead guy. Yeah. Can we? Is this a room here? Yep. Yeah, check out the room you're in first before you leave it. Oh, I just unlocked it. The albinoid description. A creature which is created by injecting the T-virus into the genes of a salamander. Characteristics? Looks disgusting. Similar to a normal amphibian. And this one's got a vagina for Yeah. <laughs> it grows with age. And Look it wants at that. to give you a hug. When young, an albinoid is small in its size, but it can grow over seven feet in a very short time frame. Ten plus hours. Wow. That's that's a lot. It's like the xenomorph. 
It says high mobility and are able to discharge electricity. These characteristics are most notable when they are underwater in their adult form. This sounds terrible. I don't like it at all. No, why would you do that? Right? I can't start doing it once going, nah, boys, let's not do this again. Yeah, this is a bad okay. idea, I think. This is, this is a good, you know, I mean, this is going to cause nothing but problems. Maybe we should kill this thing. <laughs> no, just but let no, it no, go. It's like, oh, I mean, this thing looks fucking weird, man. Let's just make tons of the fuckers. Various commands. Break like a dog. Hop on one Hit. foot. And roll over. <laughs> Okay. So how's life in the Emerald Isle, Dave? We take the army proof, yes. Okay, that goes down in the submarine area. Biohazard breakout in the bio experiment room. Yes. <gasps> Can I see the painting now? Can I zoom in? Ah, I can. There's a number. One, 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 two, two six. six. Okay, now I can get through there. Well, shock horror, Dave, but it's grey as fuck here in the north of Scotland where the sun never shines. That's why people are so bloody miserable. Yep. They've not gone through that door yet unlocked. You know, you got to go back. There is a door I unlocked there. Okay. There's a door here too, though. What, where's this go? Yeah, but... It's just, just let me check. I'm right here. Might as well check. Jeez. I, I can barely stop you going through the damn door when you opened it first time. <laughs> Hello, also John. John. 69, placeman 069. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Ha -ha. Ah, that was the door I unlocked. Okay. Well, that's just not as exciting as I was hoping for. Yeah, it's really not very exciting, is it? Oh, that one door, yeah, that was just locked. I couldn't get through it. Well, I guess you got to go back to the sub there and use your army proof thing. Maybe, because... Uh, how did I zoom in? That was really cool. There we are. This is on the second floor. Oh, that's open now because the gas has been vented, so we can get up. More, more, more importantly, the alarm's off. That's exactly right. So you're, you're, you're not, you're not focusing on the important stuff here. Right? I don't have a silver card. To... Okay, I guess I do. I don't know why it wouldn't work before, but that's cool. Yeah, discard it. Oh, maybe it was. It wouldn't let me use it because of the gas. It's just like fuck you. It's locked down. Close the bombs, Yeah. Oh, the missing doorknob. That's right. I forgot about the missing knob. OK, 
Okay, so 1126 is a number. I think that's what I need to put in here. don't know what I'm in for here. <laughs> yes. Oh, we've got a broken glass. That's usually not a good sign. That's just one of those electric salamander things that they're talking about. I need that painting. I think that's... I need it for that one room. Yeah, I'll take it. Never go wrong with some acid. Yeah. It's that thing wearing boots. It is. Sorry, dead. Dead. Where's the... Nothing useful. It's just she's On the saying, far wall. It's cracked. It was destroyed from the inside of the Great Forest. <laughs> Great. Nothing useful there either. Okay. Yes. Oh, jeez, God! Oh, it went up into the bits. Ah! This looks like a ball sign for the tail. Yeah. I wonder what I need to do here. Judging, get the fuck out. It's the, the, the general gist of this. Before it shuts the shutters and then you're screwed. Oh yeah, maybe that's it. Okay. Great, the goddamn alarm is back. Okay, um... That was this way. Barbecue. Nah, you know what? If I can avoid having to deal with those things, I'm gonna do it. You know what's not gonna happen, though, right? Well, yeah, sooner or later, I'm probably gonna have to deal with them. But... Okay. I get kind of lost in here. You know, before you know what's going to happen, they're going to jump out the wall and just pwn you. Yeah. Okay. I fell on my keys. Yeah. <laughs> really are bullet sponges in this game, it's ridiculous. Yeah. Just the fish that's hung, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, ah. Take the gold key, yes. It's a diorama modeled 
after this facility. It's missing a giant worm and a shit ton of dogs. There's a hole to put something in. Yeah, there is. <laughs> That's like a square thing. I don't think I have anything that would fit there. Memorial plate. There's something written on it. Dedicated to the training facility's completion. December 8th, Alfred Ashford. Fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, got to put something right in there, but I don't. We don't have it, so. Simple lock. I really need a lock pick. Okay. Well, let's run up to the the palace. If anything, I can get rid of that. Navy thing. <laughs> Wonder where old Steve ran off to. What if I toss with that one gene little bitch was? What? I was just about to ask where that whinging little bitch was. Yeah. Last time I saw he was crying over a corpse. Yeah. That worm is really no threat at all. Not really. Even I could outrun that. These guys could be. <laughs> Fuck you guys. God damn it. Again, though, why make so many of something with one arm? Would it not be better to make, you know, a ton of ones with two arms? You would think so. And here comes the Disney flies. Yeah. <laughs> tink, tink. He's just chilling there. He's fine. <laughs> yeah. Thinking here there was something gold. It's the first outdoor, I think. This one? No. Uh, mm, I think it's the one. In the... No, not this one. Uh. Balti keeps looking over the right like there's a gunman just off the camera. I didn't tell you what he must say. <laughs> I'm not sure on camera which one's my right. Is this my right? Or is this my right? Is it one? Or is it two? I'm pretty sure it's this door, yeah. And if it's that way, yes, get it's, because, that it's because my TV's on and Netflix is just scrolling through all the anime shit. <laughs> okay. So there's some random stuff that keeps popping up on my TV, which is why I keep looking over. All right. So I turn then... I turn it off. My my remote's way over there, and I I, I just don't want to deal with it. <laughs> it's a man's portrait. An earthenware vase is also illustrated. There's a button below. Push the button. No. Oh, tell you, I was at uh, physio the other day for a checkup. Holding a tea set. And uh, she was asking how my elbow was getting on. I said, well, I still can't hold my wrist out flat. You know. Uh-huh. Can't do it. And I never thought of it before, but you know how much a pain in the arse that is? Right? When you're, your hand's constantly at an angle and you're a lefty for putting... Uh, like soap dispensers and shit. Yeah, you know, I guess that. Yeah. Pump it, it just goes. <laughs> 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 just clean off the side, and away it goes. So is that is that your wanking hand too? Because that would be inconvenient. <laughs> yeah, 
I, I mix up. Sometimes yeah, yeah, some, yeah, that way know. it feels like somebody else is doing it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Sit in your hand for half an hour, you know. <laughs> it's fine. It's all good. Beautiful woman holding a tea strap. No. Okay, we got a vase and a tea set. I could go for a cup of tea. No. Shame I'm alone. And there's no cunt here to make me a cup of tea. How the hell am I supposed to figure this shit out? Middle aged man, red haired twins. Tea set is placed on the table. I'm almost feeling like you you want all the teacups because it certainly seems to be there's a theme. Three of those. I'm gonna do that. Let's we'll, let's look around here and see if there's anything else in here that I'm missing. Like what are these here? Oh, and there's like stairs right here. Ah. Message to the new family master. This might tell us things. Congratulations on your succession as master of the Ashford family. I hereby present you with an earthen, earthenware vase according to the Ashford family tradition. Okay, we saw one of those. As you may know, this tradition first began with the butler presenting a golden teacup as a... Com okay. Commemoration to Veronica. So we have a, a earthenware vase, a gold teacup. Are you taking notes here, Dave? <laughs> As the founder of Ashford family, her intelligence and beauty are legendary. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son, Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. Okay, so we've got... Uh, it was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. So the second and third masters, Stanley and Thomas. It doesn't really tell us ages, really. Um, but they both have teacups. The position of the family master then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother, Sir Arthur. To Sir Edward, your grandfather. That's when the Ashford family enjoyed the golden age. Cat. Passed away. Father Sir Edward Jenkins did a particular... Okay, glory guides, just as this vase continues to shine eternally. So, okay. We need the vase. That was the first thing I think that was said right here. Man's portrait, earthenware vase is also illustrated. Yes. And then woman with a teacup, which I think is here. Yes. And then the boys with the teacup. The red-haired man is holding a tea set. Yes. And then this one. Okay. That's it, right? Well, there's that one picture there. Well, it's more pictures down here than that. This is the guy with the plate. It didn't say anything about a guy with a plate. And this is a guy with a candle. It didn't say anything about that. No. So I think now we press, maybe there's a button here. Yes. Uh-oh, is that wrong? Fuck! Maybe leave? I'm playing that much Dying Light 2. When a noise like that goes off, I instantly start looking around for infected to come running at me. Yeah. Okay. Well... Let's bring up the note again. No. File. There we are. 
playing manual? No. I didn't want to do this. I have the answer in front of me. Okay. Just, just letting you know. But let me look at it again and you can tell me if it's right. Uh... Prisoner's Diary? No. Fuck! Well, what's the red one then? Nothing. Wait a minute here. There we are. That makes sense. Message card? No. Secretary's note? Anonymous note? Prisoner's diary? Fuck. Are you... Somebody calling you? Oh, okay. Always. It never seems to get the grips that this is what we do. <laughs> Time up. That one, I think. Yeah. Okay. Congratulations on your succession as Ashford's. Present you with earthenware vase. Okay. So that's the first one. I think that's right. According to Ashford family tradition. So you may know this tradition first began when the butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative to Veronica. So that's the woman with the teacup. Found, as founder of the Ashford family, her intelligence and beauty are legendary. Okay, so she's the founder. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also present when similar teacups. So uh, that is that the one with the twins? So hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. Position of the family, sir, shifted to Sir Thomas and to his twin brother, Sir Arthur. So those must be the two babies then. Ah, fuck this. I, I don't even care. What, what, <laughs> what are they? Was I, I had to be getting close. Okay. So I'll read this out. And to keep in mind that left and right is as if the big picture is at the back of you. Okay. Okay. All right, brother. Okay. Duncan. So you want the lady is first. Okay. So I was right there. Yep. And then you want the dude with two kids. Okay. That's what I thought. I must have, like, flipped those around. Okay. And then it's the guy with red hair on the right wall. So that's this one here. Yep. Okay, and, and it's, then, then it's, it's the other red-headed dude. Oh, there's another red-headed dude? Yeah. The guy with the plate? So what it says, the lady, the mom with two kids, the guy with red hair on the right wall, the other guy with red hair by the guy with the two kids. Yeah, got him. The old man. Old man. Oh, the old guy's on the right wall. Doesn't say anything about old. But I'll push it. Well, look, look at him, man. He's got white hair. So? Maybe Steve Martin had white hair in his 30s. <laughs> but he's always looked old. And then uh, the other guy, the, the other guy with the candlestick. Okay. Yeah, the, the dude with the ginger guy had no chin at all. <laughs> just like face and neck. You know, it was just... 
And then this one. Yeah. All right. Not more foreshadowing here. Take the earthenware base, yes. Now let's take a look at this earthenware base. It's going to say made in China at the bottom. Yeah. There's something in there. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! We needed that. We did need that. Okay, so now we got to go up to the... Oh, that's right. You're closing on 45, aren't you? Or are you 45 already? I don't know how old are Brother, uh, you know what? I don't know how I old I am. How old I am. No, he is, 40, he is 45, because I'm 42. Yeah, my sister is... Seven years behind me, and my brother is nine years behind me, so I always have to like try to do the math on that. <laughs> uh, uh, Avoid the bullet sponge altogether. Just yeah, I just pass it by. He's doing, he's doing absolutely no harm to anybody. <laughs> Just think, you know, if you duct taped a brush to them and just let them wander about, you just you do a fantastic job. Yeah, it's like a Roomba. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, fuck, I missed a bit. Oh. Let me get rid of this for right now. And this. Honestly, I think we'll get rid of this right now, too. Hi, dear. I heard the youngest. Oh, uh, dear! I hear your youngest took a flyer. I had to get an X-ray. What? Uh, his, his weeest man's a freaking daredevil. He's launching himself on Earth. Yeah, oh, that's the kind of kid that I would have a problem with. It's like, because, you know, those medical bills will put you in the poorhouse real fast. <laughs> I was always on my son's case. Anytime he was trying to do something I thought was dangerous, like, don't do that. One damn broken arm, and I am ruined. <laughs> oh, he's got a boot on. Uh oh. That's still good. It's as cool as my boot. He is in Canada, so you're sure he's talking about footwear? Or did he just uh, say a boot? Our, it's going to be our boot. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's around somewhere, you know. <laughs> I think I have any health, period. The health is like so hard to come by in this game. Oh yeah, but Parker Brothers in Canada, so he doesn't have the same problem as you Yankees do. What's that? With your massive uh, medical builds. Oh, yes, that's right. <laughs> Back to Dreamland, Greg. Back to Dreamland. <laughs> Size doesn't matter when it's shaped like a pretzel. <laughs> That is very similar to my boot. This yeah. is orange. I, I got a baby blue. Yeah, Canada, I would... I I wouldn't mind living in Canada, to be honest. Canada's lovely. I love There's Canada. There's a lot of my family that lives up that direction, because... Um, how the fuck did I... Is this it here? Yeah. Dave, you're saying, I'm so sorry, sarcastically, but you live in Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> just, just saying. <laughs> At least the sun shines where my brother is. Oh, oh, Jesus! All right, okay. God damn it! I hate the way the camera is. It just stay in there. You go one minute you're praising the camera in this game. Yeah, the next the minute. Next minute ah. is like, fucking, fucking stupid. It's stupid fucking camera. Fucking camera. That just is a good idea. Guns. Oh. <laughs> oh. Actually, a place not far away from my brother called Boz. Is it Bossack? Bossack? Yeah. <laughs> 
which is extremely funny. That was, uh... God damn it! You're lucky I had lots of ammo. Yeah, can you imagine... There you go. Ball Zack. Ball Zack. Yeah, can you imagine if we had, like, American-style health care when we were growing up, man? Oh, Our parents would... They'd have to sell organs. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was always hurting myself. I, I was... Breaking something new every week. Yeah, that'd be a nightmare. Hopefully these arm stretch Armstrong guys are gone. Hell, even the first time I went to the States, I went to the hospital nope. for a week. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh, oh God. get around, get around. Up, up. Up. Round, round, get around, get around. <laughs> get around. Yeah, get around. Boop. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> they really, really want to get in I mean, come on, dog. It, 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 with my recent surgery, uh -huh. how, how much do you reckon that would have cost in your neck? Of oh, God. Um, so, multiple x rays, three yeah. nights in hospital. Oh, Jesus, dude. Yeah, this, you're, you're, looking at, you're looking at at least 50 grand, if not 100,000. Easy. Yeah, just the surgery on your ankle alone would probably be damn near $50,000. Yeah. So you see why it's like you don't want to get sick in this country because it could be like a death sentence, man. <laughs> no, when you're not fortunate well, enough, well, well, what happens? You know, they just turf you out if you don't have insurance or if you can't afford it. Just like roll you outside and leave you to die, and then come back out no, for sure later on. No, but you end up, you know, having to go into medical bankruptcy. And that fucks Jesus up your Christ. credit for like 10 years. <laughs> you can't get anything if you have to do that. I mean, you can't get credit cards. You can't get, you know, car loans. Well, car loans you could probably get. They always seem to... But, you know, that bubble's going to pop sooner or later, too. It's just... Yeah. I mean, just, kids, uh, you, you could say, uh, yeah. We try not being a baby, yeah. <laughs> Here, what would you talk to? <laughs> Hello, dear. How are you? I'm hoping you don't have a funky boot like your wee brother does. And if you want one, buy one. I wouldn't recommend hurting yourself to get one. It's it's no fun. My brother's on his like I think going on his fifth week of that brace on his leg. So hopefully he'll be able to. What was it he tore again? It was, uh, he tore his hamstring off of his pelvis. He tore the muscle clean off. That's so grim. Yeah. Okay, I think I gotta go put this in the blue one now on the other side. Yeah. What has Mr. Tear been doing today? Are you out cycling? Enjoying the sunny weather that we don't have. Give it time. You'll hurt your leg eventually. <laughs> I got a mild hamstring injury from yoga. Hamstring injuries take forever to heal. I couldn't do forward bend comfortably for like a good year and a half after that. Oh, man, you must have to lie down to get, to get your money. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, now that hole in the seal. Oh no. Why is there a heartbeat? Oh, it's a merry-go-round. 
I, I can't hear sick. you because I've got headphones on. I can't hear you with these on. I can only hear him. A bit out cycling now, Lollipop is struggling to understand that you can't hear him. Oh, got it. Got it. Sorry, buddy, we can't hear you. We know you're out there, though. Thought we do. Need to learn how to type. That would do the trick. Yeah. <laughs> All right. He's not far. He's not far away. Either. He's. I did not limitless. I'm playing with he's, fire here. He's far too advanced for a young boy. Put him in there. In here. This is a very odd room. Oh, we've got something on the chair there. Oh, it's a dragonfly. Dragonfly. Okay. You gotta be able to pull the wings off. It's designed so its wings can be detached. There you go. Yes, detach the wings. I bet it's a key now. Dragonfly wings have been detached. Now, is there more? It looks like I could do more. I bet you I could push that button. Doesn't that look there's like... Only, there's only so much you can do being four. Another ten years' time and he'll be a real pain in the ass. I know I was at 14. That was terrible. Okay, so there's nothing more I can do with this then, I guess. It looks like a it looks like a key of some kind. I know, I know they removed. Let me out. <laughs> Nothing here. You'd think that clock would be something, but it's not. Yeah, a funky beat going on the cello. What's this? It's a big music box. There's just all of this stuff, but nothing's useful. Possibly a scene from a fairy tale. There's a dragonfly in one of his bluey books. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, his full attention. Oh wait, this looks like doesn't that look like there's a hole there? Yeah. Aha! Hey, picture me. Drawn on the wall. There appears well, to be a keyhole in its mouth. That's where the dragon here we go. goes. If Tyr can hear, let's have a big fart for him. There we are! <laughs> Aha! Lined up those uh, that ladder. Uh, Again, just... who the hell designed this place? So very, what, very... Were they, what were they smoking <laughs> you know, at the time? It's genius when you think about it. There's a fine line between genius and insanity. <laughs> and this, this is it. Oh, hey! You hells, hells yeah, I want to save. You enjoyed the fart today. <laughs> farts and dragonflies. Let's, let's, let's squeeze out some more farts. This is okay. <laughs> ah. There we are. There's, there's at no point, regardless of what age you are, where fart noises aren't funny. I agree. My brother would. This always grossed him out. He doesn't even like the word fart. You gotta say like poot or something like that. It's like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> what? I know. I know. I've always had the problem with people that say loo rather than toilet. Yeah. I'm going to the loo. There's guy, just nothing useful. Hi. Crack okay, it on. looks like there's something up top there. So that must be with this box. Take it easy, man. Hey, later, man. Thanks for joining. Hey, Biggity Man's back.
That was a really long shit you took there, Bear. Well, it was always a serious <laughs> one. <laughs> Confession letter? Alexia, my sister is a genius and possesses... Oh, yes, my sister is a genius. Possesses unmatched beauty. She is everything to me. I would overcome any obstacle to be and be willing to risk my life for her. For Alexia, I must re relive the glorious Ashford family, which fell during the area of my, of my father, Alexander. Together, we will restore the family name. Once that has been achieved, I'll build a palace where nobles may gather. I cannot allow the unwashed to see my dear Alexia, to whom my life is devoted to. She reigns the world as queen with her, I as her servant. Well, he's got a weird thing for his sister, man. <laughs> he, he watches her in the shower. Table. Yeah. <laughs> that really is my does. dream. Oh, and how sweet it will be. Those accomplishments will be the proof of my love towards Alexia. It is the purpose of my existence. All of the people are meaningless <laughs> and they shall soon prostrate themselves before and I. Alexia, oh Alexia, devoted to my beloved Alexia. <laughs> I bet he got the shit kicked out of him in school. Probably. He probably has private home school. I didn't go to shit for had to to just had to OR. to to or <laughs> to get ultrasound stuff. So, yeah. Oh, hey, we got another one. We've got all of the reliefs, I think. I mean, the dude's got a serious boner for his sister, and that's just not right. I I agree. I agree. Doesn't matter how fit your sister is. <laughs> Some fucked up shit. That's <laughs> still fucking messed up. A ten year old girl genius graduated at the top of her class from prestigious university. The International Corporation Umbrella Chemical Inc. offered her the position of head researcher. Well, at ten years old. Yeah, you know? She was smart, that Alexia. <gasps> is that ammo down there? It is. Awesome. I had to use some. How, how, how smart can you be a ten year old where a worldwide pharmaceutical company gives you head research? <laughs> Pretty damn smart, or, apparently. Or how thick are their current staff? <laughs> Had to go to the OR, okay. Oh, wait. We're done here. Oh, I have to be just right here, apparently. Okay, so. It's a good thing that bed never malfunctioned when someone was in it, you know that? Yeah, uh-oh. Blair Redfield, hold it right there. Oh no, it's Alexia! It's a tranny! We each other at last. A pity I must <laughs> say goodbye so soon. I am Alexia Ashford. For the pride of the Ashford family, I will kill you! Fortunately, she's a terrible shot. Yeah. Wait! What's going on? Yeah, oh, Steve! What's giving you? Oh, Steve! A secret door! Uh, after her! A secret door! Are you okay? It's but a scratch. <laughs> I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Hey! hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. He's looking under her bed. Ah. Where'd you go? I dropped this. Oh no! I did. Alexia's dress is abandoned here. Wow! She just like ripped her clothes off and ran. Yeah, like that. What's this? A wig? What did I tell you? This and... must be. Aha! <laughs> Yeah, he's been pretending to be his sister what? all along. No! <laughs> Wait. 
wait a second. <laughs> what just happened? Okay, so there never was an Alexia after all. <laughs> you mean right. he thinks he's two people? Okay, that's it. Let's get out of here. So he's got a hard on for himself. The self-destruct system has uh -oh. that freak. Activated. He's trying to blow us up along all with the entire facility. Come on. We gotta get to that. Good thing you were here, Steve. Right. Never would have figured that out without you. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, that's a, a lot of stuff you had to do just for a cutscene. Yeah. Is it this Nope. This way, okay. I'm a little bit turned around. That's not the door I went in. Up oh, there we are. Oh, I got these goddamn one armed goons down here. I gotta deal with again. Can you blame him, Dave? Her genetics are pretty great. <laughs> um. Oh my god, he spanked me twice! I think if we had to name him, we'd have to Mr. Oh, Mr. No, Mr. Jesus! There's three of them! Maybe that other one just jumped down. That's probably what happened. You don't think that'd be a good name? What? Mr. Fister. Mr. Fister? For that guy. When he got one arm, man, and he's just. pumping that shit. <laughs> No, the, the acting still has the original cringe factor. It's just not as cringe. Yeah, it's it's better this, but you've got it's like like the 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 Ashford guy is so he's cringy as fuck. <laughs> yeah, you know. Okay. You can't you can't cure that level of crazy with that guy. <laughs> he's he's full on just. Okay. Oh my God! So the other day I was watching. Uh... JJ, Resident Evil, or yeah, Residents of Evil, he was playing uh, the original um, the original Resident Evil 2, and he was trying a new speedrun method with only using the pistol and the, and the magnum, and that was it. And he got all the way to the lab. He was just kicking ass. He got all the way to the lab, ran into those damn ivies, you know, those guys that are plants, mm. and it killed him. And he was like, fuck it, he didn't save. So, started over got all the way to the final boss and got caught in a corner and it killed him. <laughs> it was like, it was heartbreaking. I was just like on the edge of my seat. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> I could just see it out with this stuff and popcorn in your oh, face. Oh man. Come on, come it was on, crazy. It was crazy. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. I felt so bad for the dude. You could just see it in his face that like. But he did. Uh, there, there's a lot to be said. For auto save, you know. Yes, yes, it takes the danger out of it. It really does take the danger out of it. Yeah. But, I mean, yeah. I I remember how fucking heartbreaking it was when you forgot to save, or deliberately didn't save. Mm -hmm. You know, you get so far. You know, a once in a lifetime play that's never gonna happen again. Yeah. And Clear. then you die. Yep. Oh, hey, he cleared the dogs out for us. Those must be the main survivors. We'd better get out of here, too. Right. Let's go. What's the fucking point? They've stolen all the planes. <laughs> the self system. They couldn't take this one because they didn't have the proofs that I have. Well, of course, you know, modern day plane security, you have to have these weird little stone. 
We gotta get to that airport. And today on Steam States the Obvious. <laughs> He won't let me drive, of course. <laughs> so I'm more like a South Park Canadian. <laughs> I'm not your guy, friend. I'm not your friend, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. <laughs> Too many times singing the Uncle Fucker song. That's what that's what that does. <laughs> Shut your fucking face, Uncle Fucker. You're a bona biting bastard, Uncle Fucker. Oh, fuck you! Fuck you! Get off me! Or I think it's this way, but I might be wrong. I mean, we can't be that desperate, you don't have a timer. No. Maybe, maybe not. The self destruct system has been This facility will self destruct at some point in the future. Never did get anything for that. Okay. The self destruct system has been. One of the best songs ever. Yeah. Uncle <laughs> <the> fucker. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody fucks out those bad ideas. It's important to have stairs. We've got to have a lift. Oh, well, he doesn't take stairs. Who's gonna fly? No! We can't take off unless we raise the bridge. You leave that to me. You stay here and make the preparations for takeoff. Yeah, yeah, you'll stay there. There's the lever. Has been activated. Has been. Activated. Oh, hey, nice. The self destruct system Thanks. has been activated. All personnel evacuate. No. Yeah, take the fire extinguisher. Couldn't stole Steven with it. Yeah, there's no, no typewriter in here, though. That would be nice to say. Has been activated. All personnel Slots. evacuate. Got it. So how did all the other planes get out if the bridge was down? 
Then up. This is where the lift suffers high bullet failure and you just stuck there. Yeah. Hop, hop between the landing and hop between the place. So is there nothing else I can do here? Okay, I gotta go back to another area. Okay. Yep. Okay. all these guys out. It makes them not to reach one though. Yes. Somewhere around here is the... thing that needs the missing lever. But well, hang on, if you move the bridge, how do you get back to the bridge? Maybe you could get across the other way. Maybe you raise it or something. Oh, the audio's audio's gone to no. shit. We're doing this. That's better. Okay, good. Shut your fucking face, Uncle Fucker. Completely blocked by the load. Locked by load, yeah. It was a big one. This doesn't... I don't know, maybe. Here it is, okay. This is where it was. Maybe she has a thing for beans. She likes the beans. Uh oh. Jim Rito's playing Fallout 4. Fallout Fever has once again gripped the world. It has. I wonder the uptake in Fallout purchases has been since the, the release of the uh, A lot. If they've had, uh, Fallout 4 is like. Uh, Number one game in Europe right now. Uh, it's here, not even a new game. It's, it's, yeah, it's been for ages. Here they're all cheap, dirt cheap on Steam. I don't know if they are over there, but yeah, I mean, I picked up four and three in New Vegas for like under ten bucks. <laughs> I've not played so much in New Vegas. Uh, it's, I don't know why. Fallout 4 and Fallout 3 are just not amazing games. They really are. Just take the airport key, yes. Oh, hands down some of my favorite games of all time. And I've lost so much time to them, it's, it's unreal. Well, what the fuck is going on here? I don't I'm not even mad about the fall of grace. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. It just, it just goes to show you that if they do a really good, uh, accurate, lore accurate style show that, you know, has all that, it, it does so much for the show. Oh, yeah. Okay. The thing with Fallout is that no two stories are the same. Yeah. You know, the basic premise is that you are surviving the wasteland for a reason. Why but is the stories are different? Yeah. Did I miss something over here? It's already dead. Okay, there's nothing over here. What the fuck? Came in here, I got the keys. I mean, I spent so much time. Uh, so I've got four with all the DLCs and everything. Combing everywhere to get every single piece of power armor I could. Just every bit. Yeah. And it hacks, it hacks me off that my big save is on my PlayStation. And I never oh, play no. it. 
and it breaks my heart that I'd have to do it again on the PC version. Man, I just, I just never play my PlayStation. I use it more as a huh. disc player than anything. Oh, you can't. Kind of, mine is down there somewhere on a shelf, where it has been for. There's the key. A long time. Yeah, I play my like workout discs on it. <laughs> well, I mean, mine's a PS4. Slim. It's not even a PS5 or anything. I know it's. I don't know. I mean, the. I mean, there's all sorts of different power armors you can get. And in the fourth one, you don't need to do any training for it. You get a shoot of power armor pretty much right at the start. It's keeping the bastard in fuel, that's the problem. You have to keep finding the energy cells. Well, I have power you... armor, but I can't use it because I don't have a, I don't have power armor training in Fallout 3. Oh! What? Yeah. There's some ammo there as well. Yeah, see him. There he is. But again, I mean, I spent so much time in Fallout 4 that there wasn't really anything that was a threat. You know, you, you, you engaged in fights for fun rather than yeah. profit. Those blocking the door, I don't know if it's be used in this situation. Yeah. I'm gonna push the loaded deeper. Yeah. Ah, there you are again. <laughs> so was the thing is, right, is you get the power armor at the start and a minigun at the start of Fallout 4. Yeah, that's really nice. But you're on top of a roof, trying to shoot down at a death claw. I just push down on the street. I just jumped down there in the power armor. I've always just jumped down and just walked through the street and blew everybody away. And blew yeah, that's, that's what you have to do. Yeah. First, first time I played it, I was busy trying to kill it from the rooftop. With this stupid gun that didn't aim on it. Uh, the, the epitome of spray and pray. <laughs> okay. Those fu fucking death claws, man. Has been activated. All I, I even played it that much that I, I, I sometimes got into scraps with extremely powerful Mylarks that just took a, took a serious kick, kick in, you know. I don't think this goes anywhere I could go. All oh. But yeah, I mean, I love the they are just blue. And the fact that there's community mods for them as well. I mean, I never played them in the mods. I, uh, yeah, I put on the, the high def texture pack on Fallout 3, which looks really nice. Uh, but yeah, the only mod I put on there was the unlimited carry weight bullshit. I got rid of that. And I looked at mods, and really there wasn't much that I thought was interesting in the mods. I mean, a lot of I new mods. That. <laughs> of course there is. Yeah. I would put, maybe put in the enhanced blood. I think that was fun. You know, but I can see the point. Well, I can see the benefit with the 
the, the no parry way thing. Yeah. Because if you, if you can just walk about picking everything up, you know, you'll never want for money. All you have to do is find a shop and just sell all the exactly. random well, shit you've got. Unless, they, unless you do that and don't realize that they, you're out of money and you just gave them all your shit for free, like I did. Yeah, well... You won't do that again now, will you? No, I will not. No. I hate how little money the vendors have in Bethesda games. I think I pull that bullshit about waiting forever for, you know, I gotta sit here and wait for a half an hour as this thing skips time for 72 hours. Hey, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan B. I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. Uh, I don't want to pay attention to the chat and shit they follow. I don't think there's anywhere I can go. Locked by the load again. That'll never, that'll never stop being fine. Yeah. He been just giving you a condition called epididymitis, which is not fun. You're gonna have to explain. It's where the uh, epididymitis is where the, the sac on like the back of your testicle that stores matured sperm. And if it ends up getting inflamed in there or, or like an infection in there, it swells up really bad. And it just makes you feel like your balls are like this big around and it hurts really bad. <laughs> that sounds fucking terrible. Yeah, maybe. Oh shit. I just had to go in this door. <laughs> I was running all over. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? I, I was wondering why it just closed. You know, yeah. why, why push the boxes just for no benefit? I know. I was like, I don't understand what that did. Yeah, right. That, that sounds fucking awful. I will fucking not awful, allow man. you fools to escape. I had that happen to me once in college. It was not good. Now feel my revenge. That's well, Tranny Ashford. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. Oh, fuck. I don't have any, like, weapons for this kind of shit. It's a tyrant. Son of a bitch. Hey, Andrew. Sorry, I missed out on two claps. Oh, it's busy. Andy! Welcome. That's for Ryan. Andy. Uh, this is for Bam. Oh my god, I am clear the fuck up here. Oh! The Rippide Games. Said Limitless Miniver. What weapons have you got on you? You have your grenade launcher. And if not, I, why not? I can run up and grab it before. Oh, good, the guys are gone. Just got blasted from behind. Yeah. <laughs> Oh no! Look what they did to my hands! I'll never play the piano again! Can't! Oh! God damn it! Motherfucker! Dude, I gave you a clap when you turned up, man, at the start. Do you want another one? <laughs> huh? I'm insists I give him the clap. Well, he, he wants the clap. Again. <laughs> my mom says thanks, by oh, the way. Oh, you died. You died. You died. You died. Oh, you missed my sad one. Oh, no, no, no. I didn't miss anything. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. Sorry. Put it added to the favorites. That wasn't a double one. Oh, that head in the clouds is actually a fart. Right. Uh, Andrew McAvoy said, I just sat down to eat some chicken fried rice. Oh, that sounds amazing. 
Alright, that should be enough, I think, to take care of that. I do like some chicken fried rice. But, uh... Singapore vermicelli noodles. Oh. Some of the best. They're there. It's fantastic. Can I just keep both these on the right? I can't. Awesome. Um, everything makes you shit, man. Everything. You take a dig, a dig, you take a big breath and you have to go for a dump. I don't forget, once you push this box in, you've got to go like, running yeah. around. And run around the for, whole damn area. For five or ten minutes, yeah. so I forget what the fuck's going on. Yeah, I was like, I was like, okay, well, I'm done then. <laughs> what else? What, what do I do now? Minutes until detonation. I'll have you know, Batman, I took a triumphant crap before I came on stream. It was that good. I was a little sorry it came to an end. <laughs> it's fucking brilliant. Bards write tunes about that sort of thing. Bards. I will not allow you fools to escape. This Andrew McAvoy said, "What is going on, guys?" Now. Everything under control, I trust. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, Alfred. Took a shit so big and made her lower back pass. <laughs> Jesus God. <laughs> That's Dr. Greg to you, motherfucker. <laughs> you know, the kind of shit we could beat it to submission to get flush. Yeah. You got a knife on the wall behind a glass, uh, you know, break glass for the giant shit. Hack it up so you can flush it away. Andrew McAvoy said I'm not referring to bowel movements just in game. <laughs> Dr. Greg is a quality horror gamer. Oh! Wow, ah, see, he just. He's just proposing, man. You know, he's not. Oh, I still have seven rounds. Well, he won't let me buy! There! Jesus. Okay, good thing I grabbed these herbs. Oh my god, I'm gonna need to. Dogs are gone. So that's good. You love the dogs. Just to get down there and find out Steve's actually fucked off the second to read the bridge. Yeah, wuss of the eyes. Are... <laughs> oh yeah, like you're not, you're not a wuss. Come on. Oh shit. Oh shit. How the. Did I fuck up? There it is, okay. Out of the whole game, I still think this is the best game. 
<laughs> yeah, I joked about them being so rich that they have lifts rather than stairs. But having a submarine as an elevator. That, the best. That, that is money. That's some Disneyland shit right there. That, 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 is, that is fantastic. Am I there? Do I have to push you from here? Yeah. I don't always do hardest mode, but I do it a lot with games that I know well, like Alien Isolation or Outlast. I like going to nightmare modes there. Nightmare and Alien Isolation, holy shit. That's serious. Nothing for loot. Your stupid motion control thing or sensor thing barely works at all. Self system. I just run like that. Don't stop. Don't slow down. Just run. leg it. Yeah. Just leg it. And no one's saving that poor fish. <laughs> Wow, it took me a long time <laughs> to just go push that lever. That's all I needed to do. Yeah. You never say it on a nightmare really in isolation, but yeah, that was that was something. That was really hard. I loved it though. It's one of the most perfect games ever. It took you so long. I was starting to get worried. No time to explain. Let's Shut go. your fucking face, Uncle Fucker! Yeah. <laughs> I'm the blade! Time to say goodbye to this death trap. Don't get two bucks while you're Steve. Good thing Steve knows how to fly a plane. I know. Annoying accent and shit here at the side. Yahoo! Yay! Yahoo! It's finally over. Now it's fine. It's back. <laughs> <laughs> it's finally over. Sir. I'm sorry. I know I caused a lot of trouble for you. No, it's okay. It was hard for both of us. Mm -hmm. Well, I really hope you find your brother. And in the meantime, let's get to the back. Get all Randy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Steve. <clears throat> so, where should we go now? I can take you anywhere you want to go, Claire. Uh, I bet you could. Yeah. <laughs> I hear Hawaii is nice this time of year. You got it. <laughs> 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 Only problem is we've only got fucking five miles left to kill. Ashford's gonna get in his tank. Ah, oh, he's gonna shoot you down with a tank. Hang on. That's... Good old German diesels. Oh, he has a oh. secret. Secret elevator. He's, he's taking a hidden passage. Yes. Boom, boom. This game is not over yet. Now you will see what real terror is all about. Oh, no. <laughs> they say it like... <gasps> Harry have both of us. It's a fucking Harrier. He's rich, man. Yeah, but in fuel, that just costs more money to lift that thing off the ground than I make in a year. <laughs> okay, that's probably not good. His <laughs> tanks from the mid forties adjust for the lady, lady. Yeah, yeah. Um, I hey, have really love carriers. Play can fly a lot yeah. faster. Thanks. I've unlocked the cargo room door. Love their alarms. 
I want the cargo to be door. Unfortunately, we're above 50,000 feet, so the second you open... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> True Lies. That's a great movie. I love True Lies. Yeah, man. Schwarzenegger had some bangers back then. He did. And there he is! Big stretch! Big stretch! And... <laughs> Catapult ready. Yeah. There we are. Okay. We gotta knock him back a bit. It's the bit in Three Lives or the Harrier where the terrorist dude goes swinging backwards and nuts himself on the, on the fucking tail fin. Yeah. That would hurt beyond anything. Oh! Oh my god, how fucking... Fuck, dude, I am in big trouble. Hang on. I'm just gonna get the sad horn ready. Oh! Run! Oh, fuck. <laughs> ah, son of a bitch. Jesus, where was the last time I saved? <laughs> that was not funny. <laughs> God damn. Oh, fuck! Dude. This sucks. Donkey dicks. Big all your rounds. Oh. I've got to save up some space. Let me get this first. Happy holidays, Ben. Yay, holidays! Happy 420, everybody. Well, I haven't had a smoke in years, but I could actually really go for one. <laughs> Me neither. When I say one, it'd be like... <laughs> this. <laughs> that, would, you know, that would kill me. Thick as my thumb. That, that would kill I'm just, ass. I'm just say goodbye for the next couple of days. Yeah. I don't know how people do that. Oh man, I used to do that sort of shit all the fucking time. Oh. There was never one and done. At all. It was always just... You know, if you were still awake, you could still keep going. Yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and combine you with you. There we are. There was one time when me and my mate of mine sat and we watched all the Star Wars films from episode one through. Like the, the latest trilogy wasn't out yet, so it was like the six films. And we decided that we'd, we'd, we'd start off by taking a shot every time someone said, use the force. <laughs> But, uh... They didn't say that much in oh, the film, Oh, God, it just got fucking ridiculous. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I came to it at one point convinced that I was going to wake up with no eyebrows. Until I like, looked over my mate was passed out anyway, so it was fine. Crane scene was great in True Lies. Sorry, man, I was just... I noticed I'm a little behind here. Self-destruct system has been activated. Oh, 
Rollins, Lord of the Rings. Oh, I have more health for it, too. Fuck. Dude, I'm taking it. Did he duck the card anymore? I don't think so. Ooh, acid rounds, I bet those are good. Okay. I didn't say you have to smoke um, edibles. Alright. Okay, we are loaded up here, so... Hopefully. Time to go die. Yeah. Try to decide if I should the first time use these. They've got more range. Yeah. You, wanna, you really want to keep your health. And, yeah. And you don't you don't have a lot of room in the plane, so maybe you could get yeah. you in there. Until detonation. Yeah, this took more to take him down. I'll probably still have to switch the grenade launcher, but it should uh, take him down a couple times, I think. I will not allow you fools to escape. This is what you get for trying to oppose me. Fuck you, now bitch. Kill my revenge. <laughs> <laughs> And again, though, why not give the dude? Why not give the dude fingers? Right? Well, why has he got clubs for hands? <laughs> yeah, what happened was uh, he got beaten to death. God, you you want to wait a while? Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, sadly, yeah. I, I met the, the tyrant was in the plane. And he kicked my ass. Oh, I feel good. Okay. First time I went to Amsterdam, I got. Oh, fuck. And I thought the best way to level myself out was to have a hash brownie. I don't know why, but the logic at the time seemed sound enough. It was a bad idea, man. I almost got run over by so many fucking mopeds, it was unreal. <laughs> you know, the, th the threat of bicycles, mopeds, and drowning in a canal. Real world problems. There. Okay. There he is. I'm still curious how he gets from there to the plane. Though. I don't know. He's a speedy little devil when he wants to be. Game logic. <laughs> I almost feel like, fuck it, I'm gonna do it. All right, well, let me do it. I was gonna go up and save. <laughs> That was pretty clean getting out of there. Tried edibles for the first time not so long ago. Holy shit, people who said careful they're strong. <laughs> you gotta be yeah. really careful with edibles. You don't need very yeah. much. The biggest mistake I made was uh, the first, like I said again when I first went to Amsterdam, the first thing I ordered was a pre roll. You know, I didn't just buy one and make it. Yeah. I just bought one. Oh, fuck me, man. <laughs> yeah, no thank you. I don't know what was in that, but Jesus Christ, I was halfway through it and I was done. <laughs> Goose was absolutely cooked. Well, that's it one of the time. problems they have here with all the states that are legalizing marijuana as they go through. Is these people are getting edibles and they don't understand that you, you know, these people know what they're doing when they're making of it. Just take one and wait about 45 minutes, <laughs> at least. Because <laughs> they don't, they think, well, it's not doing anything. And then you start eating more and more. 
and then they end up in the emergency room, greening out, freaking out. <laughs> well, no, I mean, I, I've seen some weird shit. <laughs> I've been completely fucked. Like, you know, it's it's always entertaining. But Jesus yeah. Christ. We were. Me, me and my mate of mine, one night we were down in the islands. So it's a bit with the river Ness, those do in the city. But it's, it's a series of islands. Like only a small bit, you know. But we thought, well, this is a great place to go at night and just get fucking roasted, you know. So off we did. Climbed over the barrier, hopped down onto the thing, and just went and sat out on the, the corner of one of these islands and just watched the world go by. Middle of the night, you know. We've been there quite a while, conversations worn off, you know, we're just fully fixated on whatever it is we're looking at. I hear this rustling noise behind me. So I look over and all I see is this shape leaping over the fence that we've left over, right? <laughs> but this has this like big tube You're like, on girlfriends, their back. yes! <laughs> well, they were like this big tube along their back, and I was like, fuck me, he's a ninja coming to kill me. Like, one of these fucking ninjas is coming to kill me, man. I'm trying to get my mate's attention and I'm lobbing oh, shit at him and I'm trying to, I'm trying to make non-verbal... He's got his back to me. So I'm like bouncing bits of moss off the back of his head and all this sort of shit. <laughs> like, dude's a fucking ninja, man! The ninja coming! He sees it, he freaks out. You know, so we decide it's time to go. So... We get up and we start trying to like sneak around this ninja to get the fuck out of there. So, ninja. Takes this thing off his back, sits down, starts unscrewing it, you know, takes it out. It's only a fucking poacher, wasn't it? It was just a fisherman. <laughs> but I'm, I'm completely out of my mind, and I'm just fucking freaking out, thinking there's a ninja hopping over the fence to come kill me. That's funny. I'm sorry. I know I could. Uh, I thought you said it was a sheep. <laughs> no. It's a sheep. It was hard to Oh, a sheep. A sheep. Yeah. Okay. Well, I heard a sheep. Find your brother. <laughs> I know what it's like to be. Oh, I was thinking too much about Bam's mom there. <laughs> Barbara. <laughs> so, where should we go now? I can take you anywhere you want to go, Claire. One of the last things you remember was laughing his head off, dressed in an apron it. and shorts, and kitchen knife <laughs> shouting, I'm serious. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's never good to wield sharp objects, Ben. Uh, there was one time I was completely out of my box watching this uh, weird Japanese game show called Bonsai. I swear I can understand every word that was said. <laughs> Must have been a Japanese strain, huh? It's <laughs> <laughs> fucking rough, anyway. This game no. is not over yet. <laughs> it's not now over. You will see what real terror is all about. Here in five games, set limitless Fuck. for the I love can't. of God. I can't. I can't. You can remember? It's an emulator, man. Oh, that's right. I might that be might able be to. Worthwhile doing it. I might be able to save the state. It's. It's. Yeah. This one is different though. So. When I get to a point where I can handle, I'll see if I can. I have an unhealthy obsession. With that. <laughs> hey, what the? Dad would be good. I'd appreciate it. The cargo room hatch is open. I'll go back and check it out. Thanks. Oh, Jill, there's anything wrong with the back door. <laughs> okay. All right, let's see. It can't be, it can't be anything dangerous. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Oh, no, there's a typewriter right there. There it is. There is a the typewriter right there. Yeah. Right beside you. Uh. Oh my god, right there. Didn't even see that. <gasps> well, just load your load your bolts into your crossbow. But not when you'll have a spare space. You're right. You're right. God damn it. Now I'm hitting the wrong buttons. There we are. I did not see that typewriter. Neither did I. 
for, for not something you expect to see in the cockpit. No, plate, no, you wouldn't think I'm going to find that typewriter. Dr. Dad, Dr. Daddy. <laughs> That's what Bear's Law is called. Like. <laughs> oh, there's a fucking... I thought it was Girthy Greg. <laughs> oh, that too. Do I have any other ammo for my thing? I don't. So far removed from your storage box. Oh, I've got in, uh, this. I'm gonna take it. We're just gonna take all the ammo. In Resi 2, where you just had so much shit right from the very of the work of the game. Yeah, Resi 3. That one I was just like loaded with the ammo the whole time. I never I never worried about ammo in that game. Yeah, this is what I never got, right? But people Health and safety protocols are being observed. Surprisingly no one got stabbed. <laughs> the pe people like, you know, it's like you take a smoke or you're a drug addict. It's not like I'm smoking crack or taking heroin. When was the last time you saw a stoned person starting a fight? Right? Never. Right? Never. No, it's, no, it's Doesn't matter how angry you are. You're high as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh, back to the corner. Press the button. Dock him back. Oh, I guess I could. Yeah. Did I? Uh, uh, get this. Gonna get the sand one ready. Yeah. Seriously bad way. God damn, he is like a fucking bitch. God damn. Run away. Jesus Christ. Ah. He's gonna fish you. It's being prepared. Jesus Christ. Christ, he killed me again. At least I was saved. He fisted you to death. Yes, he did. <laughs> we needed a better, better fail sound. Oh, you want a better fail sound? There you are. <laughs> That's what I'm going to use from now on. Because I guarantee you're going to die at least one more time. Oh, this Jesus. This one is tough. Okay. It's the lack of room. Yeah. Yeah. And he's not as easy to avoid as, like, the tyrant. In, in Resident Evil 1, you just run by him. He never hits you. This, well, this guy's got to reach. Yeah, he's got a wide reach. Hello. We meet again. Have you noticed I've got no penis? <laughs> I've also got no fucking fingers. What's going on? He's got a knife hand, though. Okay. Yeah, did you just cut your balls with these things? It's filled with some type of explosives. Oh, I tried to get around in there. Jesus Christ! Ah! The range on that thing is just fucking better. Yeah. God damn it. Jesus Christ, he's just... Fuck! Run, God damn it! God damn it, he's got me cornered! Just trying to get around and run! Can you just not let him spank it, fucking Claire? God damn it! 
Jesus, God! <laughs> oh, it's all over. Oh. Yeah, just, if you, you can't run around and he gets you stuck on a wall, you're just Steve, just pull up. Yeah, right? Just go straight out. Andrew McAvoy said I'll say one thing for Greg. He is persistent to get the job done. I'm gonna despite get despite the obvious difficulties. Oof. Oh no, wait, that's what Bam's mom said. Yeah. I was so chill, level head. Yeah, right? I never, like, lose my shit or anything. Oh, come on. much noise this guy you know he's just all about the killing yeah and he's always all about ah. every 30 seconds jesus god run 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 god damn it claire just fuck oh my god Ooh. hey mr survivor Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate this motherfucker. Hey, Daniel. Or Mr. Survivor. I totally didn't say your government name. Nope. I'll give my clock for being here. <laughs> God damn it. This guy is an asshole. I kind of wonder though, right? Seeing as they developed him to have no junk, does he even have an asshole? <laughs> I don't know. You know. God damn it. I just don't even want to go out there. He scares me. Oh, no. This is what I'm saying. You just tell Steve, look, I'm just, just, just 50,000 feet, man. Just go, just fucking go straight up. Yeah. And the bastard will get sucked right at the back. Or suffocate or freeze. I wonder if I knock it back first, if that would help. Yeah, this guy is not. Yeah, he's uh, he's whooping his ass. I think this is attempt number four. Yeah, I, it never takes me this long. Though. Yeah, come with the box straight off the bat. Yeah, and then yeah. just. No. Let me see if he's up for a conversation afterwards. Got the vultures, eh? Oh, fuck him up. Shit. I, I think shoot once and run. Yeah. Fuck! No, 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 no! No! Ah! Run! God damn it, Claire! Fucking whore! <laughs> Jesus Christ! This is, like, brutal! Oh. I'm, 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 I'm curious though, what does her having, you know, say she's a fucking whore, what does her having taken cock for money got to do with her getting better <laughs> the back up in? Dude, this is like, just fucking brutal. So yeah, shoot once, run.
you know there's something that's going on in the chat here, Greg, right? Is we've not said anything. <laughs> we've not said anything. Not said anything about what? And they're all roasting Bam's mum. Oh, <laughs> I know, right? I'm a good I mean, influence. Is, 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 is everyone roasting Bam's mum? <laughs> uh. It's pretty bad. Okay, this didn't do a damn thing. I think I'm going to save that for when he's down. Oh, fuck! Run away! God damn it! Okay. Uh. Oh, fuck! Like couch, big widescreen TV. Heal, man, heal! Heal! This is a good out of you, you're getting a thorough pounding. Ugh. Fuck! God damn it! Go, you son of a bitch! Acid, man. Try, yeah, try acid round and see what happens. Cause I mean, those are pretty strong in other Resident Evil games, so pretty sure you're supposed to roll that beautiful bean footage when he swings. I, there's no rolling. <laughs> I think if it was trippy, I would be too busy swatting at butterflies in the air or something. Right. Neon butterflies. Yeah, there's no roll, there's no dodge, there's just... You and this guy. In a very tight situation. Andrew McAvoy. Said give him some edibles so he chills the back yeah, out. Yeah, no kidding. I think you'd run out of money before you gave that full enough edibles to chill out. But... You uh... can't get by him without... Oh, no! No! Run! Up! Now fire the cannon up! No! You should sh you've shot the shit out and it's doing absolutely nothing. I think you just have to lure him to the end and then hit him with a fucking crate. Well, you would think after you hit him a couple of times, you know, a few times you go down like he did down in the other area. Okay, but this is what? Attack number six now? Yeah, Jesus fucking Christ. Well, that didn't seem to make any damn difference. Use the BOW rounds. Just their curiosity. What, the arrows? No, the rounds, the BOWs. Okay. The green this ones. This is a gas. Is it? Yeah, I only got three of them. Oh. What are you saving, well, what are you saving them for? Yeah, it's not, like I'm, <laughs> it's not like I'm doing any better with any others. I <laughs> Oh my god. Poor woman is just getting slated here. I know. It's it's, it's not nice. It's past being funny, guys. guys. It's, like that. It's, it's, it's just wrong. Like, <laughs> Anyone spoke shit about my mum, I would fucking ruin you. My mother's a saint. I just am so sick of seeing this son of a bitch. You love it. Yeah, I got it, I got it. That's either knock it back. 
Yep. But. Oh. Okay. Up. Uh, Up. Uh. Now cheese it right to the front. Yeah. And use the thing. Like it. Like it. Like it. Fire. Fire. Ah, it was a good one. Ah. Needs more thrust. Fucking way I'm getting out of this alive. Okay, I did. I can't believe it. I'm gonna run this by you, right? Rather than shoot them, just try running around them until that thing's ready to fire again. I can't. It's got to be that. Dude, you can't run around him. He, he gets you every goddamn time. He's like. He's got a really, he, his arms reach clear across that damn thing. Well, because he's shooting the shadow doesn't to do it. <laughs> Apart from maybe piss him off a bit more. God damn it. Okay, the thing's okay, ready it's again. It's ready, it's ready. Come on. Push him off! Push him off! Yes! Fuck you! Fuck you, you piece of shit! <laughs> God <laughs> damn it! Oh! Yeah! <laughs> oh, I don't think I've ever had that much trouble with the Resident Evil boss! Son of a bitch! Okay. Um. Who? Oh, fuck yes. Uh, now you just got to worry about the Harrier. Huh? The jump jet's still coming for you. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, I beat the Groundhog Day. <laughs> what was wrong? Oh, nothing. Oh, it's a big fucking monster in the back, Steve. What are you What's doing? What's happening? I don't know. The plane just changed direction on its own. It's flying in autopilot mode. I can't switch over to manual control. My apologies, but I cannot let you escape now. Oh. <laughs> Alfred, cross dressing freak. <laughs> the love scene is it yeah i guess <laughs> he's smoking a cigarette yes. yeah we missed that part the voice acting is the best that is great Christmas survivor don't you forgive it <laughs> i love how they just give up yeah so you've just been like a huge fucking he's like monster are you like sleeping or are you like roofy sleeping <laughs> He is, he's gonna try, he's gonna... Dude! Consent! <laughs> Fucking rapists, man. God damn Canadians. That's, that's, that's why he's in prison. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's his number on the back of his shirt there. Uh, it wasn't rape, prison Mr. Number Judge. I thought you were sleeping. This plane is made of 12 polygons. It we? is. Huh? Latitude, 82.17 degrees. It needs a blue chew. <laughs> well, this That's ain't Hawaii. The Antarctic. We're over the Antarctic. What? Can't get over the place that. Those are the seaplanes that left the island right before us. 
then that must mean this place belongs to Umbrella. Good landing. I, I'm no pilot, but I really yeah. think that landing <laughs> landing gear would be a great one there. Well, here's Johnny. Hey, well, if we walk away from it, it's a good landing. Save the first half in data, yes. Sonic Adventures. <laughs> Talking about uh, um, Steve. Press open to open the disk door and then replace this one. Oh, shit. Well, you know what? I don't have disc two downloaded. <laughs> I don't think. Oh, <laughs> what a chronic failure! I know, chronic right? Failure. Here, let's bring this up. How are we going to know what happens next? Uh, let's go to. Where am I at? Am I in Dreamcast games? Dreamcast. There we are. Uh, let's go to R. Do, 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 do. I didn't even realize I needed two discs for this. Rayman, Redfall, Resident Evil 2, Nemesis. Here it is. Code Veronica. Oh, yeah, right there. Disc 2. All right. Well, we're working on that. Du, 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 du. <laughs> that was a fail. I apologize for that. <laughs> the plane is made of titanium. Titanium polygons. Hey, man. Stronger shape there is. Yep. Oh, my God. This is not downloading fast. Six minutes. <laughs> In the meantime, there's a message from our sponsor. Yes. Oh my God, dude, that boss. That was insane. You'd still be there trying to shoot my grenades if it wasn't for me. Maybe. I was, I mean. Be honest. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it would. Yeah, it would. I might not be there at all. I might have thrown my controller and just said, fuck this game. Yeah. <laughs> Admittedly, Bob, I had a fail and a fail. This, yes. this is a first fail in quite a while. I know. This is a, it's I, been... yeah, this is a more of an insight. I'm gonna pretend it's 420. Okay, pretend. You generally don't know what's going on. The stream, no, why? That, the stream is fine, isn't it? Yeah, it's oh, still going. Fine. It's uh, it often happens when you're emulating older games that were on multiple discs. Yeah, you get to I, mean, a point I just where the disc can only hold so much data. And I just I forgot all about the fact that I needed the second disc for this game. I just yeah. didn't even think about it. I mean, what was it on the Amiga Monkey Island? I think it was twelve floppy disks. Oh my god. Flop. Now, were those the, the little hard floppies or the big paper oh, ones? Not, 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 the, not the stupid ones. Yeah, the stupid yeah. ones, the ones that I started with. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, when, when one computer took up a whole building. Pausing for suspense. Your day. Yes. <laughs> Here, while we're, while we're waiting, you know, we put a little jazz on. <laughs> I mean, we can't hear it, but you might I'll be. Have to funk out, I'll have to funk out my own jazz. Yeah, there you go. I could put some actual music on it and just get you copyright banned. No, yeah, don't do that. <laughs> Any jokes? How many mice does it take to screw in a light bulb? Two of us, you don't know how they got the light bulb? Mm -hmm. How many yeah. mice does it take to screw in a light bulb? Two, it's getting them, getting them in there that's the problem. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Here's an old one. That's pretty old. And it's an, it's an old one. 
So Doc, slowly modding Fallout 4. I've got 36 mods on it at the moment. I'm pretty happy so far. Good performance, no janky jank. Well, that's good. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I started Fallout 3 on Thursday, so I'm going to be playing with that. I'm not really modding it. I'm not, I don't really know that I'm going to be able to play it in Vorpex just because of the fact that I can't have, for some reason, when I tried to run the game, I couldn't have my second monitor on. If I can't do that, then I can't use the chat window. And I need to have a chat window in VR. So I'm happy playing it just flat screen, though. I think it's cool. It's been fun. Looks really pretty with that high def texture pack on it and all that jazz. But yeah, I do want to try. I think Ben said that he just ended up using that God's mod list or whatever and then just culled a shit ton of them out that gave it stupid stuff like all the, you know, Call of Duty I, stuff. Yeah. And uh, all the the enemies, regardless of what they were in the yeah, game, yeah. were soldiers. Yeah. yeah, he got rid of all that. That's half the fun of it, is just seeing what mutated random shit's going to attack you. Mm -hmm. Around the next corner. No, I'm going to finish my joke first. Okay. Oh, so it's an older joke, right? All right. And it's a bit, it's dated because both these people are now dead. Okay. Okay. Michael Jackson was looking at life in prison for molesting kids. Okay. Which is not a bad deal seeing as Christopher Reeve got the electric chair for riding a horse. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was so sad with Reeves. My brother was like, a, he's a massive Superman fan. And that, that, one, that one hit him hard. Does, does, does he run about in tights with his wife runs out in front? Uh, no, but when he was a kid, he ran around in a cape and stuff, and had mom made him the Superman outfit. <laughs> Fair enough. Yep. All right, we're just about there. Sorry about the wait, guys. He's not really. I really am. He's just pandering to you. It's... Yeah, uh, I, I was telling faulty earlier I'd looked at mods for Fallout 3 and there really isn't a lot I see on there that interests me um, I just like quality of life stuff like get rid of the weight limit that type of thing as I said I mean I like the fact that you can boot into to Fallout 4 in particular and mod it in game you yeah. don't have to download additional shit you don't have to do anything you can just mod it from the, the start menu which is brilliant. You know, I've never done it. I've always just played them completely stock. I do like the idea of the no, the carry weight thing. Yeah, it's carry weight's just a stupid thing to put in a game. I don't like it. I've never liked it. And God, in Starfield, it's just relentless. Okay, so let's see here. Here, we're going to extract you to D. Emulation. I remember the first time I played Fallout 3, yes. I picked up everything. I had like half a million clipboards, cups, pens, all sorts of random shit. I just picked up because it was there. Uh huh. Thought I might need it for something. Don't know what. Planning out tests. <laughs> you know. Going around people's doors to tell them the wonder of Jehovah. I don't know. It was reeks of shit that I thought was. Okay, we are, we have it downloaded. Now, I don't know, open and close the door and put disc two. So I'm guessing at this point. It just load up as a new game, I think, would you not? Yeah. Change disc. This is not disc two. Oh, wait. I may have to... Games. Trying to figure out how to get this. Well, go back to your games there, because that had the... 
the address for the uh, sorry library sorry at the address there for disk one so you want to add directory oh okay there we are d that's my emulation epic games evil dead well where's the Just be very careful and scroll really quickly past all this porn. <laughs> Where's the emulation? There it is. Emulation. Dream. Oh, nope. Oh, yeah, there just two. That's, ah, that's, yep. that's right. Okay. There we are. Aha. We'll see if this that worked. Nailed it. Maybe. See, first time that would have taken a normal person three or four days. You know what? Though I think I did it a little bit wrong. If I would have done it from the actual game screen, can get that off of there. Okay. Press start button. Load game. Resident. It evil. should start us right there. I would think. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. hey, we did it. Hang on, hang on, oh, hang on. Oh, we, we gotta we... turn off the jazz. Okay. Ah, <laughs> <hallelujah. laughs> oh. Steve's fucking David drops your way out. Maybe he's dead. Fingers crossed. He saved our ass a lot of times, so. though. Wake up, Steve. Oh. Hey, Doom. Oh. Doomsly. Doomsly. There you <laughs> I just want to say Doomsly every time I see it. Where? It's Doomsly. It was a great idea. I own a bunch of groceries and shit. Go. <laughs> All right. Thanks Take for it easy, man. Oh, why you're, maybe. While you're there. Pervert. Pardon my Mona. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a gun in your pocket? Near death experience and all that. <laughs> Sorry, I, I can't stand up right now. <laughs> oh, I just walked off. Oh, uh, <coughs> your plane's trashed. Really? Thanks What's for that, happen? Mr. Find another way off this oversized freezer. Right. Okay, let's do it. Let's fall in love. <laughs> no? No. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna hold a different direction there. Let's go ahead and equip a uh, handgun now. I really hope you don't need any health anytime soon. Yeah. Is this a door? <laughs> or where you find it, you actually have to keep those BOW rounds with your bear or something else. God. That was terrible. Here. It's a little door over here. Oh, we got stairs. You know I say it every time with these guys, right? But at what point would you just go, you know what, this just isn't fucking worth it anymore. I'm gonna go take a nice <laughs> yeah. long walk in the snow and just let you know just let hypothermia do its thing. I'm 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 done with this. Later, Andy. See you, Andy. Thanks for stopping by. There's a corpse skull on the floor. Yeah, there's a whole corpse there. Nothing but the corpse. Oh, there's some stuff back oh. here. There's lots of dead guys in here. I'm assuming that they're all going to come to life at some point. See what happens, Doom? You turn up and people just start baggering off, man. Yeah. It's, that's usually my trick. <laughs> you walk into a room where everyone's having a big conversation, oh, hey. I walk in, and everyone just stops. Oh, there's some more ammo there. Fill up my keys. <laughs> there we are. Like that. Oh, 
Nice. Oh, shit! You can see there's slow ah. yeah. Come work for Umbrella. You don't need health insurance because you never die. I had to thin him out a bit there. And this dude, oh fuck, he's fast! Managed to die, come back to life as a zombie, and only now does he lose his heart hand. Yeah! <laughs> Hurt my boot. No, that's... Now I'm done in my titties! Right? Look at me, I'm holding my boob in pain. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. oh hey, I'll take those. Do I see a map here? Yes. Where have you been, Ryan? That was like the, the last disc ago. <sighs> you skipped the got, whole bit. Got, of, oh my gosh. Of, you skipped the whole bit of trying to figure out how to get the second disc to work. <laughs> yeah. Well, at first I had to download it. <laughs> but that was, a, that was a serious download. That only took six minutes. Well, Vim's is Vim's layer is what I like to use, um, and it's. I, uh, it is. Uh, I, I, I I legally download all my torrents in uh, one yes. go. Well, I own this game on several systems, so this is just a backup. Oh, I'm, I was the same with me. Every every ROM mm -hmm. I've got, I, I own the game. Even the really yeah. obscure Jap even the really obscure Japanese titles. The the porn ones? The the, the hentai. <laughs> Never fired them up, but I had no idea there was so many porn games for the SNES, you know that. Yeah, there were a lot of them. It's crazy, I, one of my man. one of my friends sent me a disc full of ROMs one time and I put them on. I was like, Well what are these? I put them on, I was like, Oh my god. <laughs> like, what the like, fuck is this? That uh that that's not good. No, that's some sixteen bit titties right there. Yeah. Don't need my kids seeing that. But no, I mean, there, there's some the really The wife yelled at you to get into the garage and actually do some spring cleaning. Ah, oh, fuck that part. Spring cleaning is stupid. Ah, oh, Bob is back. Four yeah, games are awesome. awesome. Yeah. Of course. I mean, of course. Is. Of course, if Bob would think that the four yeah. games are awesome. Yeah. He's all about the schoolgirl shit and <laughs> dirty bastard. Bondage. Mm. Give that slap and tickle. <laughs> so we got a guy standing in here. Man, this is dark. Got something just, flashing in dude, there. Just, just, it's, not, it's not one of those fucking briefcases, man. What are you supposed to do with them? I don't know. Oh, Jesus Christ, he scared the shit out of me. It's so dark. So you think you're thinking about porn on ass arseholes, Ben? <laughs> and now we know just a little bit more about you. I could use this to process metal materials easily. A <coughs> metal shop machine with diamond cutting edge. Okay. Ammo. God damn it, yes. Health would be great. They need to give me a lot more of that. Do I have any drugs? Still listening, just not watching, putting away groceries, and now thinking about poor things. <laughs> Can I open this? No. Well, how do I get. So I came in. Does anyone need some DDR4 Vengeance RAM? Oh, hey. Nice. Couple little sticks of. I 
got an extra stick of RAM for this computer. I just never have to put it, in, put it down. Because, I mean, I've got 32 gigs. What's that? My, 11, my 11700KF ah. processor. Oh, yeah, I'm actually just looking for painkillers here, in case I don't know. What's that? Yeah. Ah! Purchase beer already. Have plenty of spotted cow in the fridge. What's spotted cow? Did get stuff to grill. Oh man, it is. It's hard to grill when it's freezing. Used to do it a ton back in the day, but okay, I can't get done. All right. The Brilla facilities are not good places. They are just full of infected people. Yeah, man. That's what I'm saying, you know, come work for Umbrella. You don't need life insurance because you're going to die. <laughs> you know, even if you do die, hey, you'll yeah, come really. back. You'll come back. You know, yeah, she'll just be a shambling dickhead in a corridor somewhere. <laughs> What's going on here? We got spider? Uh, we must have spiders down here. Someone just got spunked right to the yeah. wall. Yeah. We've got two doors here. Why does it always have to be fucking spiders, man? I really like the spiders. Ah! Okay, this is a save room, so. I did just say spunked, yes. So I whipped out the jizz cannon and just blasted up her bastard right cannon. against the wall. Alexander's memo. This is B Papa. Mm. My father, uh, Edward, discovered the mother virus in a corporation with Lord Spencer, who was also a nobleman and studied for the purposes of military use. Eventually, their study took shape, and they named the variation of the mother virus, called the T-Virus, to camouflage their research. They've established Umbrella Chemicals, Inc. I major in biogenetics and have been involved in top-secret projects supporting my father's research. However, my research went through the difficult phase, and my father died in the middle of the project. Oh, no. Nice. We are now at a major disadvantage against the other researchers, and there's a great competition in the field of the T-virus research. I have disgraced uh, the honorable name of the Ashford family that our great ancestor Veronica established. If nothing is done, Umbrella will take over, but will be taken over by Spencer. I must expedite the process. Okay, the project to its fullest without being detected by Spencer, because the Spencer Mansion is the first one, in the first game. So. After much thought, I just, uh, decided to establish a large-scale advanced research facility. It's been located at the transport terminal that I created using the abandoned mine in the Antarctic. Within the facility, I have a room built. There's a similar design my mansion... Uh, uh, it will be similar to the design of my mansion and the legacy of late Trevor. Refusing um, as fuck. Yeah, <laughs> I, I will be late to uh, cherish my sweet memories there. For secrecy's purpose, I, uh, conf or security, uh, this confidential project will be given the code name. It's the name of the beautiful ancestor of Ashford family, Veronica, who I wish to receive or revive so badly. I am confident that the result of my research will as glorious as her name and that the honor will be restored to the Ashford family once again. I don't know. Have you seen your son? <laughs> He's a bit of a weirdo. A little odd, that one. Hmm. I think Uncle Frank touched my wee bit too much. <laughs> no key can be found. Seems something is dragged down here. Oh, yeah. Well, I sure don't want to open that. Oh, was that someone is mashing one off in that fucking Probably. So I'm gonna die! I'm getting a last couple of hammies in before some, I go! Some nerd that got shoved in there. <laughs> yeah, beating his meat like it owes him money. Yeah. Fucking hell. Doesn't matter where you go in the world, there's a deviant around every corner. 
You, you need to go down that poor bastard out there. He's gonna be just shooting dust by this point. Yeah. I just wanna put that away just in case. Oh! It was just a fucking rat. Hello! Fuck you, rat! I'm Jerome. <laughs> what do we got here? Oh, the butler's letter. Sir Alfred, butler. please give me... Please forgive me, as I must tell you of my abrupt departure by leaving this letter. I first served your father, Lord Alexander, of not so and have for so long shared into the joys and sorrows of the Ashford family. Lord, Alexandria or Lord Alexander disappeared unexpectedly 15 years ago, and then an accident during an experiment took the life of our deal Alexia. Okay. Uh, if you were forced to become a master right, of the Hang family, on, hang on. I've, I've got to do this for Mr. Survivor. Uh... You know how it's beats his own... <laughs> 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 You'll be forced to become a master of this family at a very young age and nearly lost uh and merely lost your sanity from the sorrow of having lost all of your family members. See, we've been making fun of him. Don't you feel bad now? <laughs> no. Yeah. No, I really, really don't. Either, yeah. The guy is a complete wanker. He is really weird. There's uh, there's no two ways about it. There's... If I met him in the street, I'd <laughs> slap him just for looking like that. <laughs> I'm Alexander Ashford. Who gives a fuck who you are? <laughs> There was nothing I could do to, and I felt powerless. The first thought that I should kill myself to apologize. Well, that's a little much. And then I realized that I would be the insult to our dear Lord Alexander and Alexia and the other world. Scott Harmon, the Butler family. Well, I'm so glad. Push the switch. Yes. Seems to operate electricity. No response. Okay. Well, do you think it was going to work the second time? Oh, you never it's going know. To magically, going to be electric going to the switch the <laughs> second time, right? It's always worth checking, just in case. Okay, so there's nothing else in here then. Can I go back behind the desk? There's a herb there. What do you see? A herb, like a herb tarlic. See it? To your right. Oh, right there. Yeah, I had to. I will take what flavor of vape is that? He's asking. This is pineapple ice. Mm. It is delicious. It actually smells like pineapple juice. I love pineapple juice. I love Which pineapple. Is dangerous. Because, you know, idiots might drink it. <laughs> I thankfully thought about it, but thought better of it. <laughs> It is really nice, though. I mean, there, I bought some other stuff, uh, and it's so acrid. It's just grim, and I feel really bad. When I spend oh, oh, it's like a big mosquito-like thing. Moth. I'm just gonna run through here. Oh shit! It's like. Is that another herb in the floor there? Oh, what the fuck! There was something. There's a blue herb. Yeah, I'll take it. I bet you I'm poisoned or something. No, I'm not. Oh, you're fine. Okay. But yes, um, to all you vapors out there, I don't know if you get it in your parts of the world. It's right company me. Zeus Juice. Then Zeus the God. Zeus Juice. Uh, do some really cool flavors. They're really nice. They'll do some fucking terrible Someone's ones as well. Someone's gonna do it. Oh. oh. See, once again, all that time with his hat on, he loses yeah. it just at the end. It's good for him. Makes him tough. Puts hair on his chest. Along with the bullets. <laughs> yeah, there's a zombie. There he is. Let's just... Clean these guys out. No bam. I did actually once try and uh, inhale my vape through my nose just for fun. I don't recommend that. That is that is, that is really bad news. Oh, 
There's hat Scott. Ah. Audio's, audio's gone again. Oh, I'll no. be back. Stupid audio. Uh oh. Hopefully, when he comes back, it. Yeah, there we go. That's it. It's fine. Okay. I don't know why it does it. It's. It just it's, comes it's, through all staticky and annoying as fuck. It's something. Gotta have something to do with Discord. So it's, mm. you know, just leaving and coming back in fixes it. Yeah. I'm glad I'm not the only person that's done it, Dan. I really am. Uh. <laughs> Through your nose. It's it's terrible. It really is. I thought, how bad can it be? You know, you breathe air through your mouth, you breathe air through your nose. I mean, what, what's the difference? And you find very quickly you try and do that sort of weird shit. You can always count on Resident Evil zombies. Okay, I could see that. I'd like to have it, whatever it is, but I can't get to it. Weapon. Weapon. I like weapon. Damn, it's dark. You got your lighter. Oh. Okay. He'll wake up. Can I use my lighter? Let's try it. I think they said something about that at the very beginning of the game. That's better. Let, let there be light. And the Lord said, fuck no, go buy yourself a lighter. Yeah. Oh, there's something. Ooh, mining room key. Well, yes, I will take the mining room key. Yeah, but the bullet, the, the zombies in this one, Mr. Survivor, they, they just spoke up the bullets, something chronic. Yeah, it's it's rough. And you're gonna find out because all these fools are gonna come to life shortly. Ooh, one AK. I'm just gonna ruin his day. Wait for it. Yeah, I'm just waiting for it. So I never had a Dreamcast. You never had the Dreamcast? Oh man. I was I was a Nintendo kid, man. I never I never owned a Sega console. Oh, there's no door there, so that's why. Okay, well. I keep meaning to dig out my Atari Lynx. But if I do that I need to buy the mains adapter for it because it costs an absolute shit ton of money to keep the fucker in batteries. It's ridiculous. That's the handheld? The yeah, handheld? It, took, it took six AA batteries. Oh my and god. You, <laughs> and, and you would kill it. You would kill it in about an hour and a half, two hours. It would just. I imagine. It was ridiculous. Uh oh. Bioweapons. This doesn't sound good. I don't like the sound of that. I'm going to get <laughs> I wonder if we have a. I'm not running away because I'm scared. Is this how I came in? I don't. No, I came in that other one. Oh, yes, use the mining room key. You're not even going to go investigate that other room? I am. I want to see it what. Might I... just been that rat again. You never know. It might just be bounding about. That does not sound like a rat to me. Curious how the fuck that rat got in the locker. I managed to shut the door behind it. <laughs> oh, I can hop up here. And up here. Blue Lightning and Ninja Gaiden, man. Yeah, they were my two favorites. Uh, unfortunately, my Ninja Gaiden cartridge no longer works. I can't figure out why. It just doesn't. Did you ever try playing Batman Returns on it? That was one of the hardest games. One of the goddamn hardest games I've ever played. Whole shape like an octagon. Poison gas in case of emergency. Seal off. Okay. It also had one of the best versions of California games. 
No, because when I bought my Atari Lynx, I got Batman Returns for free. I got it from Toys R Us in the States. Way back when. My brother bought a Game Boy. I bought the Atari Lynx. <laughs> I got myself, um, for a handheld, the only one that I played, got for myself was the uh, Sega Game Gear, which was a really nice little handheld. See you, Ben. Okay, now you gotta go for real. Alright, later. Thanks for dropping by. Oh, I hear puppies. Alright, you've got a grenade launcher, just fuck him up. Oh fuck. Get off me, you bitch. Alright. Poor pup, just wanted a hug. Skin. <laughs> Take that! <laughs> Sega Nomad. Never heard of the Sega Nomad. Sega Nomad. I, yeah, I don't, that one doesn't sound familiar I'm, to me. I'm going to look. I'm going to look that up. Yeah, I don't remember a, a Sega Nomad. But yeah, the Game Gear was really nice. I got it. The only reason I got it was because that uh, the the Super Nintendo version of Mortal Kombat 2 didn't let you have the blood, and I wanted the blood, so I got. Uh, it's got the Sega same. Genesis. No, it's like a it's like a handheld. I don't know if you can see. Oh it. shit! It's like a handheld that takes the cartridges. Oh okay. And it looks fucking stupid. Jesus Christ! This guy's selling it. For Five hundred and fifty pounds. I might do. He's modded it with a modern T F a modern T F T. T F T is not modern, you muppet. I've got so many. Jesus Christ! They want their money for them. Four hundred bucks, three hundred bucks, nine hundred dollars, two thousand. Fuck right off. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that Don't. must be a really nice thing. Those you bastard thing. Like. There's like this blue yeah. blue light down here. I want to know what that's all about, but I don't think it's anything. Okay. Well, you can get into it where, 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 where you were with the dog there, can you? You can get in behind that. Behind this, maybe? Doesn't no. seem like it. Maybe here. Here it is. Okay. Man, that was not completely obvious. No, I, I had never heard of the Sega Nomad. Never heard no, of I've it. never heard of that one either. That's, that's, that's a brand new one to me. Hey, that one button should work now. Up in the save room. Hooray! But you learn something new every day. Sega Nomad. Yeah. God, there's all these green herbs down here. I want them. Well, this 420. Gotta get all the herbs. Yeah. I'm gonna have to go up to my save room and drop off all the shit. But yeah, I mean, I I remember in my younger days, you know, every time there was a new console, out, it was just good, brilliant. It was so exciting. Same with the games. We've we've said this before. You know, it's like. Uh, you know, you'd go into the city to pick up the game. You've been saving up for it. You go in, you buy it. You sit on the bus on the, on the way home or back of the car or whatever and read the manual. Yeah, I love that old stuff. I love it. Oh. Same with records. I used to love sitting when you could sit down with records and, uh, you know, read the lyrics and the jackets and all the yeah. inserts they put in there. The Dead Kennedys put great stuff in their albums. Lots of cool posters and... You'd always get the, the Digibox releases, you know, the fold-out ones and all this, and they were just... Yeah. It made all the difference. You just don't get it now. Oh, this is not the save room. Where's the save room at? I was tempted a while back to buy an Atari oh. Jaguar. Fuck, it was downstairs. Just for shits and giggles. 
But I can emulate all that stuff, so why would I bother? Yeah. But... Fuck you. God damn it. But yeah, you get the, you get the big... The, I think the last one of those big walkthrough books I bought was for one of the Mortal Kombat games where it had every single Fuck. move, finisher, you name it, it was all there. Video. And whatever that Panasonic thing was that they had a shot at. Okay, where's that? It's around the corner in the long, in the long thing. But now can you get back without getting munched on? Right. Survey, survey says no! Well, it, it seems like you can get hit a few times without getting poisoned. I think I'm safe. Right. Hey! Okay, so let's see, what this, see if this works now. So ah. Well, I So I remember going to... I used to... Back when, you know, gaming systems like you know the n64 and all that first came out you'd go to your local electronics joint say we had uh comet and curries and all these places mm -hmm. where well, you, you'd stand and wait for your shot to play mario 64 or f-zero or something like that that was great i loved that yeah yeah all right man i'm gonna call it for today i think i'm hungry i worked up i worked up a hunger fighting that fucking boss on that plane <laughs> <laughs> damn that tyrant was an asshole yeah but yeah Get man the jaguar controller was it was out there like it was something different completely mm -hmm. yeah the jaguar was pretty cool i remember seeing it yeah all right what was it you know there was oh, i can't remember what the games were now well, thanks for stopping by, Ryan B. and Mr. Survivor yeah, and all the others out there. It's been awesome. I love this game. I can't wait. We got it. We still haven't played as Chris yet. So there's still a whole section where you play as Chris. So uh, we'll see when that comes up. I can't remember how long that is. It's been a long time since I played this game. Obviously, because as, as long as long as it's not a disc three, we have to. No, there's that. there's no more discs. There's only two discs. <laughs> I checked. <laughs> all right well everybody thanks for watching make sure you hit like and subscribe i haven't decided what i'm gonna do tomorrow i mean i could do some vr i've kind of felt like playing jumping back into resident evil 2 remake from vr well, i've that's... all but given up on that in vr you know that why is that because the, the motion the sickness, motion sickness. Oh, I dude. Can't, can't do it that sucks Just can't do it that sucks and yeah i was i was playing demo earlier today and that was no problem at all absolutely perfect huh yeah I don't, I don't have any problems with motion sickness in that game um but anyway yeah i need to jump back into that one because I, I what i left last time was right where you get the sherry bit where you're in the orphanage um well do that keep the so, resident evil theme going yeah yeah because i mean i, mean, I want to play some more fallout but i'll play fallout for sure on thursday i might play more during the week later i don't know We'll see how once you start. Once you start, man, it's 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 difficult to put it down. I know that's the problem. That's the problem. All right. So anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Doctor Greg out. Bye.